Scottish citizens could be hit with a 50% rise in council tax bills to fill a gap in government funding, a local authority body has warned. The Convention of Scottish Local Authorities COSLA, said a change in the law was required to address council deficits and avoid significant tax rises. COSLA said £739 million of additional funding would be needed to help prop up Scottish councils. Scottish authorities have warned they face devastating financial black holes with Highland Council being the worst figures. Figures show the authority faces a £96.6 million gap in its finances due to lost revenues which represents the equivalent of £411 for every resident, the worst in the UK. The COSLA paper added, given the initial forecasts from local authorities it would require a council tax increase in 2021-22 in excess of 50%. It also claims current laws will mean council deficits would have to be met through a council tax increase. COSLA continued that council tax legislation should be amended to allow a financial deficit attributed to COVID-19 to be repaid over a period of time. It comes after the Scottish government said that it needed to borrow up to £500 million more to deal with the impact of coronavirus as well as having greater flexibility over its capital budget. A formal request was sent to the Treasury last week, ahead of a meeting of UK finance ministers. But Scottish Finance Minister Kate Forbes MSP said her request for more financial powers has been kicked into the long grass by the Treasury today. Speaking on the BBC's Good Morning Scotland radio programme this morning, she said she hoped the request would be taken seriously. She said, I last spoke to the Treasury on Friday and we went through the issues once again. Unfortunately it keeps getting kicked into the long grass and my hope is that at some point they will deal with the issue seriously and enable us to have those powers. The Scottish government is also calling for an £80 billion UK-wide stimulus package, which would be the equivalent of 4% of GDP.